Hey friend, how's it going? Thank you for tuning in and tapping in with me. It's me, Shan G. And today is another Girl Get Paid chat where we are going to be talking about passive income. I'm going to tell you guys how I started my own print-on-demand business that's been bringing me in a lot of passive income, making money while I sleep. And guess what? I did it all for free. So I got my handy dandy notebook where I took some notes for you guys. Go ahead and grab you a pen and a piece of paper because you don't want to miss this. All right, friends. So I hope you got you something to write with. It definitely, hopefully, it's one of our notebooks that I sell right from my own website. I am going to be getting into you guys, into it with you guys about how to make these. But today, I'm going to show you how to make this. Yes, we are going to talk about how to make our own or start our own print on demand business. You can do it right from your cell phone. And guess what? You don't have to pay anything up front. So you can start making money before you have to invest into this business. This is why I love it. It's one of my favorite side hustles, a great passive income stream. Literally, you can make money while you sleep. I know we hear it all the time for about passive income, but this is another way to make money while you sleep. So I'm going to go into my handy dandy notebook. I'm taking some notes because I just want to make sure that we are staying on track. And I'm going to keep this video nice, simple, and short because I want you to go ahead, log off, and get to the bag, okay? I want you to log off and get to the bag. So print on demand what is print on demand well print on demand is you basically working with another company producing your designs and they will literally drop ship or ship the items to your customers and you have to do literally nothing once you create the design once you create the product there is absolutely nothing to be done we're not going to get too technical because this is a very very simple process okay First things first, let's crack open these notes. Because you know you got to stay organized. Staying organized is the key to success. So I would definitely suggest grabbing some notebooks and planners from me, Shan G. I'll make sure that I leave the link below, okay? Anywho, let's go ahead and get in this. So the first thing you want to do is you want to find the company that you are going to be um, working with, that you're going to do your designs with. Uh, there's two very, very good companies that I suggest. One is called Teespring, and the other one is called Zazzle. Me, personally, I'm a Zazzle girl, okay? I make all of my designs right on Zazzle. It's very, very, very simple to do, and I'm going to go with you um, on the step-by-step -step process. So you definitely want to first create an account. Um, I will leave the link below. It's very simple to sign up and create an account. It's just kind of like any basic website. You put in some general information about yourself and your brand, um, and then you can create your own storefront right there. But you don't stop there. We don't stop. We don't stop there. So that's step one. <laughs> so step two, um, you want to make sure that you're making your original design. Um, I some I like to. Think. I'm a, I'm a brainstormer, so sometimes I come up with these random ideas or slogans just like this one. I was literally talking to my friend, and I was like, well, I want to be the rich friend. And I was like, you know what? That belongs on a t-shirt. And I went straight into my phone, and I pulled up my Canva app, and I created my design right on the Canva app. If you have never heard of Canva, Canva is an amazing editing tool where you can create all type of um, images graphic images that you can use for marketing you can use to create um, your print on demand designs you can use to create your low content book designs um so i i, I pretty much use cafe press for everything for my ebook covers my pod business uh, I use it for my graphic designs, my logos, when I'm making logos for friends and family. I use Cafe Press for everything. You can download it directly as an app or you can use it on your laptop. Um, but if we're trying to make this as simple as, pos as possible and you're trying to get this business launched wherever you are right now, go ahead and download ca uh, Canva onto uh, your phone. 
and you can use Canva to create your designs. They do have a lot of different stock images, but I would really encourage you to be as creative as you possibly can in creating these designs because you want something that's gonna sell. You don't want something that everybody has seen before. You want something that is going to sell, okay? You want something that you can market. So um, create your own original design and um, save it directly to your device. And then we're gonna move on to step three. So now we have signed up for Zazzle. We've created our storefront. We've created our account with them. We went to Cafe Press. We made a dope design that's so cool, so original. You haven't seen it before. You know it's going to sell. It's something that you would actually buy. Now it's time to make the product. So we're going to go back to Zazzle, okay? We're going back to Zazzle. And what we're doing is we are uploading that design onto a product. It does not have to just be t-shirts. They have everything. Um, there's companies that have swimwear, notebooks, journals, mugs, planners, socks, hats. I just personally love t-shirts because I'm a graphic tee fanatic. That's my thing. That's my, that's my thing. So I personally um, like to make t-shirts. Who doesn't like t-shirts? Who don't like t-shirts? And they have all type of different shirts. Like you could do tank tops, regular tees, sweatshirts, all type of different stuff you can do. Um, so once we, we've created our account as Zazzle, and then we're going to make a design on Cafe Press, and we're going to go back to Zazzle, upload our design onto our product. So it's a very, 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 very seamless and simple process um, for you to be able to do. So once you've uploaded your design um, and that design has been published, it's available for sale. Okay. So then what you're, what you're going to want to do is you will either want to save the, the image that you got from Zazzle and upload it onto a third party website, or you want to do like I do. I actually buy one have it sent to me directly, and I take photos that I can utilize for marketing, okay? But if you don't want to invest any money, I strongly suggest saving the photo, and then you could sign up for a company, for a hosting site. Um, there's Shopify, there's Big Cartel. You can even upload these designs on Etsy because it is your product, okay? Your original product. You can even upload these designs on Etsy. Um, so we've signed up for Zazzle. We created um, our image in Canva. We went back to Zazzle and we uploaded our image, created our product. We saved our product picture. Then we went into our hosting site, which is Shopify, Big Cartel, or Etsy. And we've created an account there, which you can create free accounts. So we're, we still have not invested any money into this product. You can create free accounts. Um, so you're gonna wanna go ahead and sign up for the hosting site and you're gonna add your product there. Now, what I can strongly suggest is if you're gonna do something like Big Cartel or Shopify, you need to get your own URL, okay? If you don't already have a website already with a URL, I would strongly suggest doing so because it just adds some legitimacy to your business. Um, it costs about 10 bucks to get a URL, but if you're not ready to invest that money, you are able to use the URL directly from your hosting site. So for example, if I um, am going with Shopify, mine would be janlove.shopify.com. Okay. Um, you also have an option to not do a website. If you have a very large fan base, um, or a very large following, you could throw these right up on social media and take orders directly to your email. You know, it's so many different options of how you want to sell the product, but really it's all about creating the product. Now, you probably like Shan, you know what? I'm not good at, at coming up with ideas. I don't know what's selling. I don't know what t-shirts to make. What, 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 what do you mean? This is something that I strongly suggest. If there is a current event going on, a holiday, or a major news event, or a major movement, make a shirt designed or created, related just for that. 
Um, for example, when Kataji Brown got sworn into the Supreme Court, I created um, t-shirts that had her face on it. And I was able to sell those right on my website. Um, also, I suggest going directly to Etsy. You can go to Etsy and you can see what is popular and what's selling, what's trending. And you make your own design based on what's trending. Don't steal nobody's design. Don't do that. Make your own design. It's called inspiration, not copying, okay? You can be inspired by another product and you can make your own. And you might even make it better. Not this one, no, baby. Not this one because we, we got this one sold and, and, and down in the bag. You can't have a rich friend, but you can have something else, okay? You can make whatever it is that you want. So we went to Zazzle. We created an account. We went to Canva. We created our original design. We went back to Zazzle, uploaded that design onto a product of our choosing. We then saved that photo of that product, added it onto our website. Now, we need to do a little marketing, okay? Now, if you already got you a good following, this is going to be an amazing and easy business for you because all you got to do is throw that design on there and boom, you're making money. The orders are coming in. But if you don't have that big of a following yet, then you want to do some online or social media marketing. I would strongly suggest um, making, creating a page just for your business. If we're doing bougie girl t-shirt designs, make a bougie girl t-shirt page on Facebook and start advertising from that page. If you don't want to do all of that, word of mouth is always good. You can always send direct text or messages to your followers, to your family, and to whoever is going to support and buy this t-shirt. Or you could be like some people, throw that bad boy up on Etsy and let the marketing happen for itself. Okay? Now, so we have created our account on Zazzle. We created our design on Canva. We went back to Canva and we uploaded that design, creating our product. We added that picture of that product onto our personal website. We've done some marketing and let everybody know about this amazing product that we have. And now... It's time to count those coins. Let the sales roll in, friend. Let the sales roll in. I, I, I love to see it. So I'm super excited. I hope that you guys really go forward in launching your own print-on-demand business. Of course, if you have any questions, concerns, or you need a direct consultation, I will be more than happy to assist you. I will leave the link in uh, in the description box below so that you can book a consultation for me with me. Um, I'll also, of course, leave the link to my direct website so that you'll be able to see some of the print-on-demand products that I've created. And I'm also going to leave my link to uh, Zazzle so that you can get some discounts off your orders when you start placing those orders and having them shipped directly to your customers. I hope that this information finds you well. I really hope that this was able to help you out. And I hope that this gets you on your path to become the rich, the rich friend. Woo! I'm so excited. I'm so excited for you. I hope that this works out for you. Hey, once you launch that business and you got that website, please let me know. Come to my IG. You can slide in my DM with your link and that's it. Um, you can leave your information below. I would love to check you out. I would love to support your business. I will make sure that I'm sharing with all of my community because we all deserve to be on. Until next time, girl, don't get mad. Girl, get paid. Love you.